all the science that points in space that I can get and I see the galaxy, that's when I know that Trump is a bad person who is not a good man like Ronald Reagan was, who cares about me because he is nice and warm. She's one of these female cops that, that fires the gun instead of the taser by accident. And they said that at the police department. They said um, that, um, thanks for calling. Yeah, we're, she's, a, she's an active duty police officer. Uh, she's retarded. Everybody in the, on the force hates her. She's always accidentally shooting people um, instead, of, uh, instead of tasing them. Evan, can you play small female cop tries to arrest a man for riding his bike? I ain't about to leave, but it's no Give me your ID so that I can Officer Adam Eleven, we have a 416 on a male riding a bicycle. And that's if you're black, my tip to you is when you talk to the cops, do this. You are me, Bobby. Adam 416, we have a male on a bicycle on a sidewalk and we are arresting him. I can't let you go until I fill out my 416 form. It's 116, Adam 11. This is what happens. This is what happens. So one of the officers knows me so You need to give me your ID. Excuse me. You need to give me your ID. You need to give me your ID. You need to give me your ID. Dude. Okay, okay, okay. There we go. MMA. Hey, it's good. MMA takedown. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Don't touch me. I got it, bro. Don't touch me. What a motherfucking mess we are living in. Look at this. Oh, my God. Why is he touching me? Hey, I got it. Hey, I got it on film, bro. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. This fucking retard carnival. I'm not giving you nothing. Bro. Let it. Hey. Get off me. What is you doing? What is you doing? What is you doing? Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Now. You hear her talking here? Hey. You hear her? Hey. He started choking him for a sec. Look at this fucking asshole. Wearing a helmet. He's got his crash helmet on. Ah, look at the top of his head. Turn around. You call when you're in trouble. I'm not doing that. Turn around. You can you can pause it. If you if you're in a city, <clears throat> um, you need you have to get out of the city for many reasons. Um, but if you live in a city long enough, I promise you, at some point, a uh, police officer, one of, one of these fucking people that walks in. Oh, I saw the police officer was hiring. I'm going to get a job with me, the police officer. Now I have a badge and a gun. 416, Adam, I'm 12, 416. You have to give me the 416. You have to do this. Okay. At one, at some point, you know, if it's a white cop, whatever, it's the same thing. In a city, you're going to fall victim to this. You're going to cross the street at the wrong time, or you're going to make a turn without your blinker turned on, or you're going you're gonna to be... I don't know, walking without a, without a seat belt. She stepped on a crack. Uh, she, you stepped on a crack, you broke your mother's back. Show me your ID. Show me your ID. At some point, this is going to happen to you. This is just the, the fraying nerves of society. Cities, cities are where the fraying nerves of society are at their most jagged. And racial or not, whether it's a, you know, the racial stuff certainly does not help the situation but if you live in a city at some point you're gonna get fucked with by one of these f uh, fucking f ass cops and these female cops no disrespect to anybody no disrespect to anybody and it doesn't matter what race you are either <clears throat> if you ever catch the eye of a female cop Hope you wore your bulletproof vest. Hope you got your vest on, man. I am praying for you, unironically. You ever catch the eye of a female cop? Man, I hope you wore your vest. And I, I am praying for you because that gun on her waist at some point is going to accidentally go off. Okay? She's going to draw it out thinking it's a taser. She's going to have her finger on the trigger before she's ready to fire. She's going to do this because you didn't put your hands up fast enough or whatever. Something you did made her feel f threatened. You're taller than her. She feels threatened for her life. She's a female. The only recourse, the only recourse she has physically is to shoot you. And I just hope that if you ever get pulled over by a woman, 
you're wearing a fucking bulletproof vest and a Kevlar helmet. I hope you're decked out like a PUBG character, because that's what you need to survive a female cop encounter. And in my notes, I wrote that um, this female, the way she's thinking, and it's not her fault. It's not the female cop's fault, okay? Because in her brain, what her brain is naturally geared to think is, I'm going to chop up some carrots and broil some beef in a stew for my husband. But then society steps in, scrambles the message and says, I'm going to chop up a citation for this dude on a bicycle. Court pays a fine. Shoot him. Okay. That's the way it gets scrambled. So it's not, it's actually not her fault. It's actually not her fault. It's the police training, scrambling the natural message. Carrots, beef, stew, husband, shoot, fine, court, citation, me, power, belt, utility belt, taser. Woman, vagina, ovaries, breasts, breasts, mouth for sucking, gun, taser. Shoot, court, fine, court. Go to court. You breathed wrong. You went through the wrong door. Court. You're going to court. Court. I'd rather have ED-209 facing, facing me down. I'd rather be looking down that, the barrel of those guns than deal with a woman cop. And that's for real. I'm not trashing women right now. I don't have, I'm not anti-woman. I would rather <clears throat> be staring down the barrel of ED-209's blaster cannons than have a woman cop with her hand, with her hand on her gun, thinking that it's her taser. Like a fucking retard. No offense to women. They're mostly smart and they do science and they're probably the reason why we have rocket ships. And they invented the internet and computers and also medicine. And women did all this. And, um, and they give top. I love that. Let's get 1080p on this bitch. I love this. I love police activity. I'll punch you in the face again. Police activity. I'm a cop. I punched you in the face again. I'll punch you in the face again. Did it a couple times. Yeah, she fucking kicked me. Evan, can you find the part where she uh, is beating on this woman? She kicked me twice. Don't grab her. Let her go. Do not kick me. If you kick me again, I swear to God, I'll break your arm. Yes, she fucking horse kicked me and she was For those of, for those of you who don't who've never um, controlled a woman, <clears throat> it's really easy to do. It does not does not require any sort of punching or anything like that or any sort of flail, flailing around. Literally takes like two seconds worth of upper body baby, strength to. Baby, you want to watch Toy Story? Put a put a woman's um, arms behind. Let's go to Armsley and make her stop. I got I got crepes from Appleseed. Um, this is a this is a female female police officer, and it's a Spanish cop, so it's not a white. Joe, did you turn, beating someone up did you turn me down it's a a spanish uh, a female police officer punching a i believe a pregnant woman in the face <laughs> which <clears throat> look <clears throat> maybe the maybe the woman you know maybe she is outside stealing and doing xanax and um maybe she maybe she did uh, kick the female police officer but punching a punching a pregnant female in the face is like that's pretty insane, man. That's pretty. That's pretty. Uh, that's what I call next level. That's pretty high flying, if you ask me. Um, and this all this all boils down. All goes back to the fact that women are women are de are defenseless. So if you put a badge on a female and you tell her that tell her that she has to go out there and physically control people, she's going to do this by punching them in the face, and if that doesn't work, pulling her gun out and shooting them. 
Um, Jocko Willink talks about this on his podcast that I have watch every episode of because I'm in the, I mean, I mean, I can't tell you what branch of the military I'm involved with, but the U S Marines basically look at me like I'm a God. Um, so I have to stay up on what these little guys, Jocko Willink, he reports to me, but I always check on what his podcast is. And there's a, th- a thing uh, they do in the, in the army. It's called a battle jab. And it's when you stab somebody with your rifle. So the barrel, the hard, extremely hard rifle barrel hits somebody and that's how that's how um prior to jujitsu i mean that's how maybe they still do this but that's how you're trained to calm someone down if someone is if someone's resisting and you can't use lethal force you're supposed to punch them in the face and use battle jabs with your rifle which is um insane whereas anybody with six months or a year of uh bjj can completely control a normal person without hurting them seriously the thing we didn't see in this video here that maybe with joey if you uh if you're paying attention you can uh, when you when you're editing this you can put it in this female cop she's a big dumpy ass and she's walking around with a big ass and uh you know what i'm talking about a big fat fat ass female cop with navy blue dickies okay work pants and the, the stitching on these work pants is stretching and the pussy and ass are marinating marinating all day in the squad car okay and she's testing out the stitching with this big ass. And she's so fucking powerless to control a 120-pound woman that she, need it, that she immediately needs to, to whip out the asp uh, baton and start swinging. Fucking retard. Um, Evan, can you play um, the next clip, Female Begs for Life? Do not buy Zoom stock. If you have it, sell it. A police Let's, officer. Uh, next time, let the, the ad road. play. She's checking out a suspicious vehicle. This is wild. This is wild. In this police body this is the pinnacle of female law enforcement. What are you doing parked back here? Here we fucking go. Do you happen to have a driver's license on you that I could see? He seems nervous. She's on a Almost dark road in the sense. woods, this solo. Is back here. This is, doesn't normally happen. The guy tells her he doesn't have a license. I just have to make sure, you know, you don't have any warrants or anything. Which I'm sure you don't. What Here we go, baby. Let's get female on that ass. A fugitive wanted for murder. He gave her a fake name of James Duncan. They're not finding a DL uh, driver's license record. For My name's James Duncan Donuts. How did you come up with that name? Looks down at a Dunkin' Donuts cup. I don't know. There we go. She begs for her life. No, no, They struggle. I'm powerful. I'm equal to you. From another angle, you can see the backup unit. As Officer Tedesco struggles, her backup opens fire. Boom! Pop, 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 pop. His real name Pow. is Martel. My name's James Duncan Donuts. And I love Duncan Donuts. Uh, I mean, my name's uh, Tim Starbucks. Uh, shit! No! Don't kill me! Don't kill me! No! Yeet! <laughs> that's uh <laughs> that's like robocop or terminator 2 right there that's how i know i'm in good hands when the protector who's protecting and serving me and issuing me a citation for my bicycle as soon as danger breaks out she's she's there with her rocket launcher going no don't kill me <laughs> no 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 <laughs> no 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 all right, last one. Let's click Texas officer fired. I don't know why I shot. <laughs> oh, my God. I love that. Um, I think a lot of cops probably think that if you're if the vehicle is moving, they have the right to shoot you because it's like you're in a you're in a weapon that's threatening them. The vehicle is. Oh, God, yeah, to the dome. Yeah, she just shot someone right in the face. Are you okay? His face is blown in half. Now the passenger's like, oh, he's like, oh, shit, please don't shoot me. He's getting out. Imagine just running alongside someone's car. They're shooting as <laughs> yeah. they're going away. They're going, like, mad slow. Like the worst thing. Oh wait, he's getting away now. Oh, she didn't even, again. She didn't even sh- hit him with the first shot. She hit. She hit him, but he's running. What's up with this guy? 
Oh, that's a cop. Doesn't want to die. Oh, that's the car. Yeah. Which one was shot? That one? No, the uh, the guy that ran, I think. Your incident has been updated. Your incident has been updated? It's a Robocop. <laughs> incident alert. <laughs> incident alert. You shot someone in a car while they were driving away from you. You shot through someone's window. Imagine a girl trying to break it. up with you and she starts walking away and then you just shoot her <laughs> yeah, in the head. Yeah, yeah. It's like really easy to become a cop too. Like com like comparatively to other shit that you to would becoming think. a doctor or something, yeah. Yeah. Like I mean it doesn't take Oh wait, hold on, hold on. Can you turn it up, Evan? I'm gonna get in trouble. What? I shot it. That's my a the side door. Huh? I Like he just started to turn the wheel because I told him to get out the car, and I see him turn the wheel, and then I see his hand getting ready to take off, and I'm like, "Don't do it! Don't do it!" And so I'm moving over with him, and he kept turning, and then I was just like. Shot. I don't know why. I don't know why I shot. Oh, man. Alright, you yeah. can pause it. No, 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 no. I'm good. I'm just... That's, like, a perfect example of why police training is, like, bad. Like, how bad... No, it it's be. not even training. It's this person. Like, giving giving the power of life and death to a mental child. That's what there's I'm no... saying. And the the fact that they she didn't get screened out. There's no... Yeah, that's... Yeah, no. That's a good point. The fact that Look she at was her able face, to man. Out. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's so fucking fucked. One of my favorite videos, oh my god, is um this guy. He's uh, I couldn't find it, but it's a police activity video. It's this guy who he's the all these cops roll up on him, like ten cops, <clears throat> and he and he says um he starts putting his shit down. He says I'm sorry, guys, I'm gonna run. I'm going to run, and they're like, don't run. And he's like, I'm sorry, I'm gonna run, and he so he runs. And then I think a I think a female cop shoots him, as he's he's not armed or anything, and so he's he's laying there on the ground and he's like bleeding out and all these cops are surrounding him, and um, it's like very clear that he should not have been shot, and I, the female cop is screaming, um, she's screaming you're okay and like keep talking to me like the stuff the stuff in movies that you say keep talking to me man you're okay you're gonna be okay. But she's doing it like you can. She's hyperventilating as she's doing it, like she's really, I guess, worried about having just shot somebody wrongfully. She's like, "You're you're okay, you're okay," and it's 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 the most like grating, loud, painful thing to listen to. And I I'm, was I was watching. I was thinking, this poor guy. Can you imagine like if you if you're dying and that's the last thing you hear is your is your killer, your inadvertent killer, s saying movie shit to you. You're good, man. You're you're gonna be good, in like a high pitched fucking female voice. 